<laughs> you melted your shoe off. Is, are those old or new? They're like brand new. <laughs> what do you put almonds in? in chocolate. Oh, that's disgusting. Trip number five. We're about to get on the ferry. First ferry trip. Is it five already? Yep, number five. Hello, goodbye. Uh, we got Corey behind us. Yeah. First time I've been on a ferry in a couple years, so pretty excited about that. It's an hour long ferry ride. luxury resort camp spot. Oh, look how clear the water is. Little swimming hole. About to see how ridiculously easy this tent is to set up. Hopefully it's recording. It is. Oh. We'll man the camera. Halfway done. Fix this cam right here. There you go. I did. Forget to put my tarp down first. That is pretty big. It's up. Two. I thought you said this was a two-person tent. That's a one bob tent. Yeah, it is a one bob tent. Super custom fireplace setup. Yeah. This is way too nice, dude. I guess I can stay in a state park, sacrifice for a view like this. Ooh, look at that tent down there. Of course, this is the gazelle pop-up. The T4. Uh, yeah, T4, four-person. It's 94 by 94 by taller than me. That's, That's ridiculous. Crazy. Come on in. Coming in. Oh, wow. Yeah, look how much room there is. So we got the cot, although I forgot my mattress. Or no, not Sleeping the, bag. Sleeping bag, yeah. Yeah. I forget something every trip, so. It's pretty warm in here. You got the sun beating down. Let's we'll see. Uh, <laughs> got my tote of stuff that normally has to stay in the car, but got so much room in here. It's got four pockets, I believe. Right here, you slide them in, and then it's got the pockets over yeah, here too. Yeah, lots of pockets. Yeah, another screen pocket. It's got eight windows, and then obviously if you don't have the rain fly on, you get a sunroof too. Pretty dang sweet, if you ask me. Is it worth the money? Oh yeah, this is the most I've ever spent on anything camping. It's yeah. two seventy nine. Wow, I can stand up fully. Yeah, dude, I stand up fully in there. Yeah, big time now. Nice sweater too. Yeah. Start renting that thing out. So I don't, I don't see any tent over here. Right. I'm got I'm going to say that looks surprisingly comfortable. Yeah, that actually does. I've got this because my two. my bed didn't come. It's going to be here two days after done camping. Awesome. So I'm using these for when Jimmy and I did a cross-country road trip in the back of a yeah. van. So and cots. <laughs> not my first car camp and rodeo. It's my second. <laughs> uh, so I've got just doubled up on those because I already owned them. Bought this sleeping bag goes to only 20 degrees. So it's not a zero, but it does sleep two people and I could double it up. It's pretty giant. I, like I have this. a mosquito net slash sunshade and multi-purpose here. So you keep the window cracked, it can go through. I installed the little eyelids as I call them. Aerodynamics, That's five right. extra horsepower. I'm keeping all my stuff up here and it can open from both it's sides. It's still got the is... stickers on it. Yeah, I like those dudes yesterday. that don't take the stickers off their hats. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it can open from both sides. And so Ooh. almost everything kind of fits up in there besides the cooler and stuff. That's pretty awesome. We've got some Diet Coke. We've got, you know, the body armor. So that's important. We've got... Uh, In case we get a shot. Yeah. Can I get a Diet Coke? we got the bacon. Yeah, hey, I got the exact same yes. bacon. All right. Got some cheese. I got the exact same cheese. 
You said you were too cheap to buy cheese. No, that's I why I bought the little. Cheese. I bought the little singles. I love then cheese. Then I got Nathan's bagel dogs to cook on. I'm the, curious uh, to see how we cook those. You just put them on a stick. I brought the sticks. Oh wait, this thing might be cold still. Beaver butthole is where raspberry... Google it right now. I am 100% serious. I don't know if it says that on here. Probably not because people wouldn't buy it. Artif yep, artificial flavored. Artificial beaver. Beaver bunghole. I mean, it sounds to me like I need to start breeding beavers. I'm disappointed. It's December and I'm the only one with the Christmas spirit. Got All the right. solar set up here. Wait. Shouldn't you hang it from the tree? There. I could. <laughs> yeah, that's how it works. <laughs> Meat press, utensil, 7 inch skillet, an 11 or 12 inch. Still, Still coated in flavoring. Packaging. Yep. Nice. One of my favorite things to do is read Amazon reviews. I don't know why. Like on the tent, like somebody was like minus one star because of the D shaped uh, doors. And he's like, I trip getting in and out of it. And I'm like, just lift your, just lift your leg, dude. And then the very first time I went in, I tripped. <laughs> All right, so the first so duh was pretty good. Apparently, it's made with alfalfa honey. Next, we're gonna try triple X. Ugh, caramel coloring. That's not a good sign. That's kind of a oaky afterbirth. You melted your shoe off. Is are those old or new? They're like brand new. Yep. So you melted I, the glue. I, I did mine too. Look, this is all melted. Okay. I'm gonna see if it'll melt back on. <laughs> oh, where's the camera on that one, Jimmy? If it's actually rolling right there, if you look over there and say Where? you melted your shoe, <laughs> I melted my shoe. My thermals, dude. You know how warm these are? Look, palm trees. That adds 15 <laughs> degrees. Ooh. And they got the almonds in it. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, there's almonds. Oh. In the marshmallow? No. No, you idiot. <laughs> what the f where do you put almonds in? In the chocolate. Oh, that's disgusting. What a waste of chocolate. What a waste. What a Very tender. Yeah, that's West. <laughs> this is a terrible idea. Oh, there we go. Ooh, it's bubbling in there too. Ooh. I don't know if you can see. Oh, no, Just on. chug it. You can kind of see bubbles in there. Chug it. I get the right. <laughs> <laughs> you look so stupid. Hey, I, I don't get to choose what yeah, I look yeah, like. Yeah. All right. It's not like when you're born, they, you get a checklist of what you get to look like. Dang, make fun of me. Where do you put my chopstick?
All right, so here's where we're at. No sleeping bag. It's currently about 46 degrees, so it's not even that cold out. Uh, I do have an extra fluffy coat that I'm sitting on, which is awesome. Uh, I also have the mover's blanket down here that I forgot about. Uh, with this jacket, I'll be just fine. It'll be a breeze. And uh, yeah, so nighttime, going to bed. See you in the morning. No sun today. It's supposed to rain. Hopefully we can get breakfast and hang out and packed up before it starts raining, but we're not in any hurry. Probably gonna burn the eggs. Hey, actually using the meat press. That's right, for my cheese and the, and the hash browns. Oh yeah. That yeah. actually tastes good. Good Pretty job, good. Bob. Good job. Yeah. And we're not gonna have any leftovers. We are breaking down. Breaking down. Bob's tent was here. Yeah. Well, they got the, not a time lapse, but hopefully it'll speed it up. Okay. I did film it. It's super easy. The, uh, there was no condensation like the Coleman tent. Um, of course, it wasn't as wet either, but still, amazing tent. You got Corey breaking down over here. I'm almost done, kind of. Let's see how he's doing. He fit everything on top there. See is where he slept here. Nice Coleman fridge. I love that setup right there. It's pretty awesome. You got fog rolling in. Actually, it's been here all day. It's supposed to rain today, but luckily we've been out of it. We're about to leave, head up to uh, Mount Constitution and get some views, and then head back for the two o'clock ferry. Jimmy! Yeah! For a second! Next time it's definitely snow. Well, that's gonna do it for this trip. Thanks thumbs up, thumbs down. <laughs> boop, boop, boop. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>